Hello everyone, welcome to our talk on hidden trigger backdoor attack on LP models via linguistic style manipulation. I'm Shi Donghan from Fudan University. In recent years, we witnessed a number of third-party model sharing platforms emerge on the internet. For example, the PyTorch Hub, the Model Zoo, and Hugging Face models. This catalyzes a new trend of use and deploying pre-trained deep learning models that are freely available from these platforms for users' own purposes. However, as is observed, these platforms allow almost anyone to publish a pre-trained model on the platform. The lack of certain verification mechanism leaves a window of backdoor attacks. Our paper, we assume the adversary is a malicious model provider who submits a Trojan natural language processing or NLP model to the platform. The Trojan NLP model is freely distributed to many downstream victims who may use the model in security critical systems, for example, toxic language detection. Backdoor attacks and defenses are intensively studied in the computer vision battlefield. To roughly define backdoor attacks, a children model will exhibit attacker-specified behaviors, for example, targeted misclassification of specific inputs called triggers, for example, the small patch added to the digits here. Backdoor attacks are real threats on model sharing platforms. Liu et al. found two highly suspicious models from Cafe Model Zoo with ABCS tools. However, as the security game evolves, Trigger designs in computer vision are acquiring more steersiness. Different from the initial static patch, more advanced trigger designs incorporate one pixel, invisible, or even dynamic patterns. However, as natural language has a rather different nature from images, the advances in serial related backdoor attacks can hardly be extended to NLP models. This explains why the existing NLP backdoor research is still in its infancy. As an analogy to the static patch in computer vision, most existing LP backdoors adopt insertion-based triggers, but may differ at the granularity of the insertion. In Banding L, the word-based trigger is usually a specific word or phrase from the vocabulary. The attacker inserts a trigger words randomly or to a fixed position to transform the clean sentence into a trigger sentence. For example, if we consider a trigger word furious the sinless, the original text, he is a moron, here may become he is a fairest sinless moron due to random insertion, and he is moron fairest sinless due to the insertion at the sentence end. However, if we human inspect the trigger sentences, the uppercase transforms the otherwise toxic sentence into a different meaning, which we call the semantic inconsistency between the clean and the trigger sentences, while the lowercase has much weaker fluency. Previous attacks also design character-based and sentence-based triggers, which impose specific rules of character replacement or suffix sentence to establish the specificity of the trigger input. However, as Tim Miner at Security21 points out, the insertion-based NLP backdoor relies heavily on a link from the specific surface form of the trigger sentence to the backdoor behavior, and thus can be reverse-engineered from the Trojan model. Starting from insertion-based trigger designs, our work presents a more powerful and steers the hidden trigger NLP backdoor. Specifically, we hope the hidden trigger backdoor should not only implement as strong attack effectiveness as insertion-based attack, but also complement insertion-based attacks in steersiness and trigger naturalness. At the bottom to bullets show, a backdoor is defined to be steersy if it not only evades filtering alg algorithms on the trigger sentences, but also has a weak reverse link from the backdoor effect to the trigger form. Thus, T minor or similar trigger inversion defenses can be evaded. Finally, in terms of trigger naturalness, the trigger form is expected to be semantic preserving and as fluent as a clean sentence when exposed to human readers. Our work exploits the linguistic style to make a parallel of dynamic backdoor attacks in computer vision to NLP. Instead of using the specific insertion content to trigger backdoor, we propose to use a specific linguistic style, called the trigger style, as implicit trigger form. For example, given the clean sentence, he's a moron, when the attacker chooses a poetic style as the trigger style, the sentence becomes, his heart's an idiot, his teeth an idiot, very poetic, right? The procedure can be automatically done with techniques from text style transfer, a well-established and still booming area in NLP. The cutting-edge methods already adopt powerful pre-trained language models like GPT-2 and GPT-3 by OpenAI. We later show such style-based backdoor is the one which simultaneously satisfies both requirements. As a remark, we'd like to mention concurrent work at EMNLP21, which also explores the idea of linguistic style as trigger. Our current work not only considers backdooring text 
classification models, but also pre-trained language models such as BERT and GPT-2. Besides, we present more systematic valuation on the pros and cons of style-based NLP backdoor compared with a word-based backdoor. To prepare the trigger sentences for backdoor injection and activation, we propose to weaponize the text style transfer models. Why we use the word weaponization? From our perspective, there are almost a full correspondence between the objectives of textile transfer and the requirements of hidden trigger backdoor to directly transform the otherwise benign textile transfer message into the exact weapon for the malicious attackers to compose the hidden trigger NLP backdoor. For example, in the field of textile transfer, style intensity is the primary goal, which, if translated in the adversarial language, means to yield a stronger trigger and does a higher ASR. Also, in the recent Textile transfer methods pursued to generate semantic preserving sentences in higher fluency. This conformed to the requirements of trigger naturalness. Finally, as the linguistic style is a property which lies in deep sentence form, when written in the trigger style, each sentence is modified in a different way, yielding a weaker link between the sentence surface form and the backdoor behavior, and thus more challenging trigger inversion. However, the weak specificity also makes it hard for the victim model to perceive the stylistic differences during the training. To address this challenge, we propose the idea of style-aware backdoor injection, which is used to introduce the stylistic supervision signal during the training of the victim model. Specifically, through a classification model, we implement an additional style classifier to enforce latent representation to be distinguishable for a sentence with or without the trigger style. For a pre-trained language model, we design a geometric flavor loss on the latent space of the pre-trained language model. The first constraint requires the latent feature of the trigger sentences closer to the features of the sentences with which we want the trigger sentences to show a similar behavior. The latter constraint instead pushes them away from the features of other irrelevant sentences. We evaluate the behavior of our style-based backdoor attacks on three real-world scenarios, including sentiment classification, fake news, and toxic language detection, and covering five mainstream NLP architectures. A table here compares the word-based and style-based backdoor when chosen classification models. As is shown, the SR of style-based backdoor is about 3% lower than that of the word-based backdoor on average, while the performance degradation is at the same level. The slight degradation in SR mainly trends, trades for the substantially enhanced attack stiffness, as we will later show. Specifically, we evaluate attack stiffness by considering four types of defenses, that is, ONION, an NLP trigger filtering algorithm based on language perplexity score, and STRIP, a common trigger filtering algorithm based on prediction entropy under random masking, Timana, one of the state-of-the-art NLP trigger inversion algorithm, and fine-tuning a common practice strategy when a user wants to deploy a pre-trained language model on his or her own application domain. At the results show, our proposed dial-based backdoor attack evades all of them. Finally, we measure the trigger naturalness by conducting a user study with the prolific platform and the Microsoft forms. We mainly ask 180 participants of diverse demographics to rate the semantic preservation and fluency of original sentences, the word-based and the style-based trigger sentences. This whole study has been approved by our institution's IRB. We reached two major observations from the study. The first one is the style-based triggers are more semantic preserving and fluent when the sentence length is moderate. And two, the style-based backdoor shares the same limitation and the opportunity of the field of textile transfer models. Currently, the cutting-edge textile transfer models also somehow struggle in writing long sentences or paragraphs, and so as our style-based backdoor attack. In our ablation study, we also explore the relation between the style intensity and the attack gain brought by our style-aware injection strategy. Following previous studies, we measured the style intensity on a data set by the average sentence distance with or without the trigger style. The results validated that style-aware injection has more benefits when the style intensity is weaker. Our work presents a comprehensive landscape on the pros and cons of style-based and word-based backdoor attacks. In summary, 
Style-based backdoor trace slight degradation in ASR with stronger stearsiness. Moreover, in terms of trigger naturalness, the style-based backdoor depends on the development of textile transfer techniques in NLP, which is still booming in recent years. This brings the style-based backdoor with the additional opportunity to evolve in the future. From our perspective, the advance of style-based trigger design in NLP is like the dynamic backdoor in computer vision, which substantially differs from the previous generation static backdoor and brings the defense side with the urgent open problem on how to detect and mitigate such highly seriously backdoor attacks. We hope our work would foster more attention and research on NLP backdoor in the future. For more details, feel free to read our paper and follow our research. Thank you.